Somewhere in the dark and nasty regions where nobody goes stands an ancient castle. In this dank and uninviting place lives Burke. Hello! Overworked servant of the thing upstairs. Burke, feed me! But that's nothing compared to the horrors that lurk beneath the trap door. For there is always something down there. In the dark, waiting to come out. Don't you open that trap door? You're a fool if you dare. Stay away from that trap door. Cause there's something down there. Irritating fat blob. <laughs> oh, Clarbits. What's he want now? What is it, oh large and floppy one? I need a bath. A bath? Certainly, sir. So. I'll just get it ready for you. There you are, sir. Just how you like it. Nice and thick and slimy. That's lovely. Which bit shall I wash first, sire? Shall I start with these three lumps at the back here? Oh, bliss. Ugh. Giving him upstairs a slime bath must be a revolting job. Shut. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, how lovely. He's feeding his babies. I do wish you'd be more careful, Drudge. Now, what are you doing? Drudge, pay attention when I'm talking to you. I don't think that's a worm, Drudge. I think you'd better put it back. Leave it alone, Drat. You don't know where it's been. It's... Put me down, put me down, put me down, put me down, put, put me... How's that then, sir? I think that's all the various holes and creases mucked out. Am I not fragrant? Oh, a rare stench, sir. I'll be off now. Help! Help! Oh, oh, oh. I'm being abused most oh. terribly! Help! But this creature won't leave us alone! Stop playing with my friends! Oh, oh, Buck, I'm filthy! I said leave my friends alone, you! Or you'll get bonked! Oh, 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 I'm coated in vile scones, unclean, unclean, unclean. Do you have the same trouble at your place on bath night? <laughs> Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lie there in ungoo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Down there. Uh. 
He's a big un. Haven't seen him before. Lucky I got something handy to bonk him with. Right, you, that's enough of that. Now push off. Well, at least now I can get on with me cooking in peace. I hope nothing else comes out of the trap door today. Right then, let's get to work. Ah, ah. I loves cooking, mind. Ah, look at that then. I particularly like all these squiggly wiggly bits. Very tasty. Personally, Buck, I find it all rather revolting. Oh, shut up! And you! Ha! That shut them two up. Oh, hello then. In you go. And a few pickled woodlice heads to taste. I think cooking is boring. What's that? Oh no, not him again. Sniff that. Ooh, oi. Got him. It's Bilbo back. He's back again. Oh, globbits. I hate that little yellow thing. Oh. Now where's he off to? He's chasing Drut. Oh, chasing Drut. Oh, that's all right then. I'll carry on with me cooking. Oh, it's going to be one of them days. Hello, Burke. How's things? Things ain't too good. That blasted Bubo's back. Who's Bubo? Who? That's Bubo. Oh, yeah. Now where's he off to? He's gone into the kitchen. Oi, get out of my kitchen! <laughs> oh, right. If it's a sponge fight he wants, then a sponge fight he gets. Horrible little irritating custard coloured. Eat! Oh, well done, Rog. Now try this one. Oh, oh, that's attractive. Don't you? Oh, Robert, do you something wrong? Burke don't like you. That was fun. Thanks, Rog. That was beginning to get a bit hectic. I enjoyed that. More fun than mucking out him upstairs his various nostrils. Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails and lost there in a goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. So I gotta find some way to sort this out, or him upstairs will go raving rancid. What I need is. Ah! This should do the job. Come on, me little beauty! There! That's that then. If you've got a problem, stuff a worm in it. Now I suppose I better go and do some cooking. Oh, that's funny. Only he's not in his hole. We are up here, Burke. We are hiding. You're doing what? We are hiding from a hideous monster, Burke. Oh, yeah? Well, where is it now, then? Ah! Oh, oh! There 
Cheese back. You're the expert on monsters, Buck. What do you think it is? Oh, looks like a giant flying sponge. I think you'd better get rid of it. I intend to, Bony. Right then, sponge face. If you don't clear off, I'm going to give you a sound bonking. Right, you ask for it. I think I'm about to get a headache. <laughs> Sorry about that. Oh, clear off! I'm going to have to get rid of that thing before old multi warts upstairs sees it. Horrible great flying luck! Go on, shoe! Oh, I do hope Burke manages to get rid of his age rot. <laughs> Go on, shove off! Go and fly round somebody else's place. <laughs> Go on, shoot! Scat! Fat green sponge! That's it. Clear off! And don't you go coming back. <laughs> Dutch, what's the matter? That's right. Fly off somewhere else. Oh, him upstairs and gone bananas if he's in that thing. He can't stand the sight of anything he can't eat. He can't eat sponge. Well, sponge cake. But that's not real sponge. That's sponge, really. Well, I suppose I'd better make sure everything's okay back at the castle. Oh, love it. Me pipe must have come unbunged. How am I going to clear this lot up? What you need, Burke, is a great big sponge. Big sponge. Hello, little spongy. You can come back now. I was only playing. Hello. Spongy. Hello, spongy. Creepy crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lie there in a goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Stay away from that chapter. Cause there's something down there. I say, Burke, what about a game of I Spy? Oh, Bony's been moaning all day about being bored. Go on, then. Right, I'll have first go. Now, let me see. Ah, something beginning with... T. Oh, that's an easy one, Bony. Drat. Not quite, Burke. The trap door. Now I get another go. Something beginning with... Oh, beginning with O. Crap! It's open. What is? The trap door. Look, <laughs> quickly. Not now, Bony. I got problems. <laughs> oh. Oh. I've got a body. Crap, crap. Look at me. Rot! Come back! Rot! <laughs> oh, Drot, we can go running together across the swamps, me and you. Where are you? Ah. Why are you hiding from me? It's your old friend, Boney. Oh, I feel wonderful. Back. <laughs> Back. Look at my body. Oh, what a flipping mess! We get on very well, my cooking today. Oh, what are you doing here, then? Oh, oh, 
Oh, that's peculiar. I've got a funny colour. It's quite smart, actually. Buck! <coughs> Buck! Oh, hello, Bony. I like your body. Why, thank you, Buck. I like you, Red. Grut! You've gone green. Oh, now yellow. And blue. Oh, what a wonderful, wonderful day we're having. Oh. Can I help you? And what are you doing in my hole? It's not your hole, it's my hole. No, it's not, it's my hole. My hole, my hole, my hole, my hole, my hole. My hole. My hole. My hole. Yes? I can't get back in, everything's shrunk. You think you've got problems, there's a very rude head in my hole. Oh. <laughs> What's going on? It's all very strange. How am I gonna get back in? <laughs> Bony! Oh dear, I think I can feel a headache coming on. This is almost peculiar. Drunk keeps changing colour, and that's quite great. Bony? Bony? <laughs> you all right, Bony? You've been moaning. Oh, I'm sorry, Burke. What's the matter with you then? It was just a dream, Burke. A horrid little thing made everything peculiar. I reckon old Bony's out of his skull. Horrid little things, I ask you. <laughs> Creepy crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lie there in a goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. upstairs has gone away for a few days. We haven't got anything to do and we're all bored. I know! I got a great idea. What about a game of hide and seek? Yes, Burke. Hide and seek. That would be exciting. <laughs> What's hide and seek? It's a game. You and me go and hide. Yes. And then little Drut's got to try and find us. All right, Drut? <laughs> but first... We don't want to make it too easy for him. Come on, Bony, let's go and hide! Ha! He'll never find us in here. My, this is exciting. What happens next? I've never played hide and seek before. Just drop, come and find us now. I don't think I've ever been so excited. This is quite the most exciting. Sorry. Hmm. Actually, it's not that exciting. Shush. Mm -hmm. then, didn't he, Burke? Hide and seek is quite exciting after all, isn't it? Oh, it is, Bony. Hang on. There's something else out there. What? Shh! I do wish you wouldn't keep shushing me, Burke. Shh! Oh, no, whatever it is, it's got in here with us! Oh! Oh! Ah! Oh. oh, it's some kind of horrible gooey custody thing. Help. I bet it came out of the trap door. Bert, I'm home. I... Where's my dinner? Oh, Globitz, his dinner. I forgot all about his flipping dinner. Burke, 
Uh, I know. I'll send up that horrible thing. Coming, uh, sire. Uh, custard surprise on its way up. But what about me? Oh, oh it's I forgot about Boney. Oh, lovely. Oh, that Connie Sue is delightful. Oh, very nice work. But next time, leave the bones out. Goodness, Burke, that was awful. I never realised that him upstairs was so repulsive. No, he ain't a very pretty sight, is he, Boney? And he only saw the front end. <laughs> Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lie there in a goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Stay away from that trap Cause there's something down there. Look, hurry up. I can't see properly without all my eyes in. Oh, I ain't clean here, or it's slimy eyeballs. What did you say, Bert? Oh, nothing, sire. It's a lovely eye. Hurry up. Right, finish. Now, where did I get it from? Ah, oh, Bert. That's not where it goes. Oh, well, keep still, sire. Oh, drop it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, dear. I think Burke has dropped him upstairs his eyeball. Oh, it's gone downstairs! Oh dear, it's gone down the trap door. It looked like his best eyeball, too. Oh. Hello, Boney. You haven't seen an eyeball anywhere, have you? Yes, Burke. It's gone down the trap door. Oh, glob it. Oh, you better get. <laughs> Where did Burke go? Oh, he's fallen down the trap door. Oh, globbits, what a globbiting day. No, I'm down the trap door where all them horrible weirdo things live. <laughs> Including big onkers like him. Oh, well, I suppose I'd better go and look for old Fatty's eyeball. Oh, oh that's a long way down. I hope it ain't down there. Ah, there it is. Up on top of them rocks. I wonder how the heck the flipping thing got up there, then. <laughs> ah! That's not the eyeball I'm looking for. Ooh. This looks a bit weird. Looks like a big cave of some sort. Maybe old Fatty's eyeball is in here somewhere. Oh, I'm fed up with this. The flipping thing could be anywhere. Oh, oh, Nessa. What a stink. It's worse than him upstairs feet. What was that? Oh, look. There's the eyeball. I wonder how it got there. I hope it isn't stuck in that hole or in upstairs and go bonkers. Yeah, there's that horrible smell again. Hang on, there's something funny about this place. The walls are all wet and slimy, and that green thing looks like a tongue, and everything's over there look like teeth. Oh, glob it! I'm inside the mouth of some horrible thing! Found it then, Buck. Oh. oh yeah, I found it. But it's a good job him upstairs didn't see what happened to it. But I did see, Buck. I saw everything. Oh, Glabbits. I ate eyeballs. Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. 
slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lost their in on goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Lots of wiggly, slimy, crawly things coming out of the trap door. What's he moaning about? Burk? Right then, now where was I? Oh yes, sliced worms and a bit of eyeball jam. Lovely. It appears that Burke is ignoring me as usual. He always does. Lover. On its way up, oh great round one! And about time to! Oh, that bungs him up for a bit! Greedy bloke bag. <laughs> oh! I stood on a bug pipe. Hey, Boney, why didn't you tell me about all these bugs then? I could have made some nice bug burgers. <laughs> oh, there's a lot of them about, ain't there? I ain't staying round here. Come on, Boney. We better go somewhere that ain't quite so crowded. Well, we should be safe from all them bugs up here, Boney. I do hope so, Beck. Most unpleasant. Have you ever seen so many horrid wiggly things? <laughs> they give me the willies. I suppose I'd better think of some way to get rid of them. <laughs> Drunk. Hello, Drut. Fancy a little snack? <laughs> well, that's that idea gone for a... Ah! Ah! Oh, 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 hey, oh, dear. Burke has fallen through the roof onto him upstairs. Get out of my bed! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I am sorry, sorry. Well, I must say you're looking well. That, that a new ward, sir? What a nice colour. Oh, 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 oh. And that was the minute I need my beauty sleep. Dear. Now I've got two problems. One great big problem upstairs and seven million little ones downstairs. Unless, with a bit of luck, them bugs have all gone home to tea. No such luck. There's a million of them. Boy, haven't you got homes to go to? If him upstairs is in a bad enough mood already, he'll burst if he sees this lot crawling about all over the place. Hello? Now, I wonder if I could use this bug pipe. There, all the other bugs. Dear. Come on, you horrible lot! Follow Burke the Bug Piper! Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lost their in on goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Down there. <laughs> cool, look at that. Makes your mouth water. 
Right, I better take this up to old Fatty Slappy upstairs then. Hey, what's it? What's going on? Is that you? Stop mucking about. Oh, glomits. I think it's time I got rid of that flipping truck. Right then. I'm fed up with you getting in the way, so I'm gonna get rid of you for good. Hey, say, Buck, it wasn't really nice. Things is gonna be a lot more peaceful without him mucking about. Now I can get on with me cooking in peace. Poor little trot. I shall miss him, you know. Oh, look at the state of my kitchen, flipping drut. He wasn't too bad, really, Buck. He was a useless fat bug. Running about eating worms. <laughs> making stupid noises. Oh, globbits. I suppose I was a bit hasty, wasn't I? I know what I'll do. I'll get him back now. A nice fat worm. Drat likes a nice fat worm. Don't worry, Boney, I'll fish him out. But he might have been eaten by something hideous. He might have, yes. Still, let's have a go, eh? Whoa! I think I got some of it. Is it drat? Ooh, what a little sweetheart. Yeah, it's not drat. Well, I like him. I think we'll keep him, but... But... Oh, well, I suppose he is better looking than drat. In fact, he's quite sweet. I think old Bowley's getting to like his new friend. Bit of company for him. Ah, I hope you haven't got any nasty habits like Drut. Ah, ah, What's up, Bony? It's got nasty big teeth and it made a horrible noise at me. What are you moaning about? He looks all right to me. But he... You sure you didn't fall asleep and dream it? Of course not. Uh, go away. Hello then, cutie boy. Oh, look at that. He loves that. Look, Boney, look. <laughs> oh, it's got horrible big teeth. Uh, oh, what an appalling creature. <laughs> oh. uh, hello. It's Rog. Look what I found. Oh, you've got little Dretty back. <laughs> Remember this. It's better to have what you've got than to get rid of it and not have it. That's what I reckon. Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lie there in a goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Stay away from that chapter. Cause there's something down library, Boney. Where is he? We can't find little Drut. We've been looking for him everywhere. I think there are more important matters to consider, actually, Buck. He must be around here somewhere. Ah, there he is. What are you doing mucking about behind there? He's acting a bit peculiar, Boney. I wonder what he's up to. Oh, leave him alone, Buck. It's me you should be thinking of. Why should I be thinking of you, Bone Bonts? I knew it. You've forgotten, haven't you? I knew you'd forget. Forget what? It's my birthday. Is it? Yes. It's his birthday. Happy birthday, Boney! Tell you what I'm gonna do. Make a birthday cake. I forgot all about your birthday. <laughs> 
Right then. Why are there so many crawly things in your kitchen, Bert? Ah, that's what I call my active ingredients. Trouble is, some of them can be a bit too active. And then you got to bonk them. Still, enough technical stuff. Let's get on with your birthday cake, shall we? Yes, Burke. That would be very nice. Oh, look at that. I'm really going to enjoy my birthday. How old are you, anyway? I'm not sure. I bet you're really old, aren't you? Ooh, uh... Hello, Burke. What you doing? It's Bone Bonce's birthday and I'm baking him a cake. If you hang about for a bit, you can try some. I've never had birthday cake. It looks nice. Ah, well, you just wait till I've finished. There you are then, Boney. What do you think of that? Wonderful, Burke. My very own birthday cake. Happy birthday, Boney. Happy birthday, Boney. I'm deeply moved. Well, if Drut was here, we could have a birthday party. Ah, there he is. Well, fancy that. He's had babies. Oh, odd. So that's why he was hiding. He was building a nest. Oh, Mark, there you see my birthday cake. Oh, ain't they lovely? But they've eaten my cake. Well, I never. Grut nippers. I think I love them. Well, I don't. They've completely ruined my birthday. Don't worry, Boney. I didn't really forget. You didn't? No, of course oh. not. I got you a present. Oh, Burke. There you are, then. What do you think of that? Oh, how wonderful. My very own wig. I feel so young again. You know what? I just love a happy ending. <laughs> Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lie there in a goo. I think that's got rid of all that horrid rubbish, then. Goodness, Burke. You gave me a terrible fright. I thought it was something hideous from out of the trap door. Oh, stop worrying, Boney. Nothing will get out of there with all that rubbish bugging it up. What's that noise? What was that? I don't know, Burke, but it sounded awful and smelled disgusting. Ah, that reminds me. I expect it's done by now. Better go and have a look. I forgot all about it. I hope it has Old Labbits! What's that ugly thing doing in my oven? Ah! Another one! Old Labbits! Ah, they're all over the place! Phew. I wonder where they're coming from. Dear, how am I supposed to get on with things with ghoulies popping up everywhere? Still, they won't find me in here. <laughs> ah!
dear. It's one of them horrible tattoos. It's just drutting his nippers. Hello, you lot. I've oh, got a bunch of ghoulies out. I just been. Can you hear something? Yes, Burke, it's coming from the trap door. Oh, Globbits. What the? Oh, no, love. I say. Oh, what a mess. All me rubbish has come back out. I suppose I better chuck it all back down again before him upstairs finds out. He'll get the exploding warts if he sees this mess. Be honest, Buck. I think it would be very unwise to throw it back down the trap door again. You oh, never... shut up, Boney. What could possibly... Don't chuck your rubbish. Oh. What was that about? Actually, Buck, old chap, I think you've just been told off. Oh, funny that. I had a feeling they were trying to tell me something. Creepy crawly slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs and snails that lost their in a goo. They'll wait down there forever till they get their hands on you. Stay away from that trap Down there. Sawyer? No, it's not. It's coming from downstairs. Oh, I'll go down and have a sniff about. My word. What's that thing doing there? Whatever it is, it smells most unpleasant. I wonder what it is. All right, then. Where's that stink? or anything. Be careful, oh, back old chap. I don't think it does anything. Smell I wouldn't get too close, Burke. It might bite. Oh, don't be silly, bony. Oh, it moves. Oh, Burke. Brightest idea Rob's ever had. Ever. <coughs> Who squeaked? Not me. I don't squeak. I don't squeak. Well then, it must have been the lump. It must have been the lump. It's a squeaking lump. It smells. I reckon it... Oh! It honked. It squeaked. Then it honked. I wonder what it's going to do next. <laughs> oh, fancy that then. Oh. Uh. 
<laughs> I think it's finished. That's one of the weirdest things I've ever seen. I wonder what it is. That bark is a honking, squeaking, foul smelling lump. What, really? Well, you don't see many of them about then, do you? Stuffing himself all day. If he don't stop soon, he's gonna yeah. burst. Ah, he's done it now. My goodness. That sounded quite awful. <laughs> oh, oh, I've split my pajamas. Oh dear. I suppose I'd better go and get my sewing stuff. Served him right for eating so much. Poor old Beck works really hard. Oh, oh. oh. My good friend, Buck. In the bog. Well, that's him upstairs. Oi, what's going on here? Splund. Well, call me the Splund Popper. Oh, well done, Burke. Ha! He was nothing but a big bag of wind, Boney. Oh, a big good crack. Creepy, crawly, slimy things that stick on to your skin. Horrid beasts with tentacles that want to pull you in. Squirmy worms, slugs, and snails. Down there forever 